Hey what's up guys this is Satish the Motorola One line looks to be expanding again the first Motorola One device launched nearly a year ago with the name Moto One Power last month the Motorola One Vision was launched and it featured the company's first punch hole display the next device looks to be Motorola One Action the one label relates to all these devices running Android One, so that makes one thing clear that it will have close to stock Android. The Moto One Action will be priced lower than the One Vision and for that there will be some sacrifices to be made. So first let's start with the design. The Motorola could be offering a glossy plastic body in replacement for glass body found in Moto Vision. We are seeing many manufacturers using plastic bodies to reduce cost, which is normal these days. On the front, the render reveals that the Motorola One Action will flaunt a punch hole display just like the One Vision. And it will feature a 6.3 inch screen with a resolution of 2520 into 1080 pixels giving you that same 21 is to 9 aspect ratio. This is specifically targeted towards people who are primarily using phone for media consumption like Netflix, Amazon Prime Video and others. The idea behind a 21 is to 9 display is simple. You will find some movies in such an ultra wide format meaning they will fit perfectly to such a screen with no borders. Problem is there is also a whole lot of other content that's made in 18.5 is to 9, 16 is to 9 and other aspects which will mean that elongated screen format backfires for a lot of content. And talking about the screen dimensions, it's more of a tall than wide, so it might feel weird to hold at least in the beginning. The phone will utilize the Samsung's Exynos 9609 processor aided by a Mali G72 GPU. This chip is just the underclocked version of Exynos 9610. The big picture here is these both chips are not that powerful. It's comparable to Snapdragon 660 processor which is becoming obsolete now. The main highlight for this phone will be cameras. Interestingly, One Vision which was launched just had two cameras and for Moto Action there are reports suggesting that it will have a triple camera setup. The primary shooter at the rear will be a 12.6 megapixel sensor and a 117 degree wide angle lens and a depth sensor. The device will also become equipped with a 12.6 megapixel sensor for selfie. The battery will be a 3500 mAh but no information is available on fast charging. The handset will come in 3GB and 4GB RAM variants and 32GB, 64GB and 128GB storage options. USB Type-C and 3.5mm headphone jack will also be supported. And as per rumors, it's said to be priced at Rs 19,000 approximately which is just a thousand rupees short of One Vision and it's expected to be launched next month. So this is it guys, see you next time, don't forget to like and subscribe, peace out.